anywhere in the world, but you're here with us. We appreciate that. Uh. H to the Izzo, V to the Izzo. For shizzle, my Izzo used to dribble down in VA. What do you think so far? Pretty good game. Yeah? Yeah. Do you think High Kill are better or worse than you expected? Yeah, worse. <laughs> Is that Swedish humor? No, uh, no. No, it's true. Yeah. <laughs> Honest too. Did you expect it to be 5 0 by now for High Kill? Oh, no. It isn't. Haters want me clap, they chrome, it ain't easy. Cops want to knock me, DA want to box me. What do you think so far? Yeah. Okay. Bad, eh? Yeah. It's all right, eh? Are they better or worse than you expected? Not as good as what I expected. Do you notice a difference in styles with a kind of Swedish approach? Not really, no. No? No. No difference at all. No. Fat off. Shizzle, my nizzle used to dribble down in VA. H to the Izzo, V to the Izzo. That's the anthem, get your damn hands up. H to the Izzo, V to the Izzo. Not guilty, y'all got to feel me. How was it out there for you? Fuck this shit, man. It starts with one thing. I don't know why, it doesn't even matter how hard you try Keep that in mind, I designed this rhyme to explain in due time All I know, time is a valuable thing Watch it fly by as the pendulum swings Watch it count down to the end of the Are they better or worse than you thought? Um, I don't know no, Truth be told, I don't know what to expect Yeah uh, So these teams, you would expect them to be strong you know, and we're proving that just now. They're a strong team. Can you see how Kill going over to Sweden? Yeah. Oh, it depends. I'd need to talk to my sponsor about that. That wouldn't have happened if I would. That's Stevie doesn't understand. You don't take me off. Ever, regardless of what's happening. A tactical change, Eric. Uh, need the two, need the heavy boy there, and at the back with the boot jack. We, I believe, we have more um, uh, speed in us. Born hustlers, I was birthing them. H to the Izzo, V to the Izzo. But she's my easy, keep my arms so breezy. Can't leave rap alone, the game easy. Haters want me clap, they chrome, it ain't easy. Yeah, the voice is sweet. <laughs> Uh, what we're doing is for this charity, as I spoke to the boys, the guys have donated I think about £600 a sale, which is amazing. Well, we are like, we're like, we're like, we're like, Listen, this is a legend, guys. He's already buying him a drink. Yeah, that was not bad, mate. Aye. Good to get you a goal. Easy ones. Thank you very much. Thank you, bud. Very physical side. Aye. Well, I'm very sick tough. You like to go all the Ampli? Damn right, mate. Coach, do you have your ankle holding up? Aye, I thought not right, mate. What do you think of the game? Aye. What do you think of the game in the Sweden? Good game. Aye, I thought the Swede scape was a good game. For sure. Yeah. Aye, I think we should go to Sweden for a return leg. I've already spoke to Eric about it. The finances are there. Fortunately for both teams, no scuffles broke out during the post-match celebrations. No doubt it was the sound of ABBA that had a calming effect on the players. A team to be sort of pre-season, uh, get some of the guys together. This year we've managed to get the, the uh, 20, 20 is coming so uh, as you, you look about and you, you see yourself so it's a great location uh, to get a team together, get everybody having a good laugh, you know just sell good and guys get together, it means they can all bond together. Everybody, except for myself, had a wee run it, even uh, yourself Eric had a wee run it. Uh, you can see throughout the, the whole tournament, the guys all really enjoyed it and that's what it's all about, that's why we're here, to have a laugh and have good fun. 
After a hard day rolling about in the mud, the boys relax on a hot summer evening in Dunoon and reflect on the highs and the lows of the season. Uh, for me, being recognised, Archibald being recognised as one of the best teams out there now. I started one game this season as the best game of my life, really. First year, high point in the football team. The last. <laughs> oh, that's right. Yeah. So, what did you think of the first time doing it? Swamp soccer. Ah, that was good, that's good. You came back next year? Aye, no, why not? What's your high points for your game of high kill? Um, one of the trophies. What's your low points? Being that when you went to see your life and that. And the low points? There's not making any finals this season. <coughs> uh, lo- losing to Cash Mark Dynamo twice and three times actually in games we should have beat them. Being a sub every week. Losing to Carlton soon. Uh, letting ourselves down in a semi final. Uh, for whatever reason, but we let ourselves down. Yeah, I'll bring us a bash up again. Yeah, you pay. Who are you up here, brother? I throwing three each with Vela Lee. It's good the team's been going for ten years. It shows there's a lot of commitment with the, the boys around Hackle that could keep a team going. You've seen a lot of teams just fall away and just disappear. So it's a lot of, there's always a lot of good players in Hackle and hopefully the team can go longer than ten years. I think it's kept going because you get a good laugh and it's all too serious and hopefully it goes for another ten years. <coughs> I think it's just in the management. I think the management that's been running the team with now is actually fucking sponsorships and everything else that we've had has actually kept us going. I think Steve does a grand, an excellent job. He does meetings, everything. And then just parts out as well for the easiest. Top notch, to be honest with you. The team, I do have a bit of phone in that. Usually does <coughs> his fair share, but Steve does a good 75% of it. The run of the team, and they do, I think he does a fabulous job. Another linchpin at High Hill is goalkeeper and captain Jasper. I think this, I think the draws captain is for me is has been an honour for the to, to date with the team. This season alone, I think I've actually improved. This season, been not just been captain, but I think I think everybody's been been better this year. <laughs> but last year. High Kill had a different captain. I'm the captain for the High Kill now for well, the 10 years apart from this season and uh, one season beforehand. I know it was my fault, I lost it. And, uh, unfortunately, hmm? it wasn't, a, wasn't a something I chose to do. I mean, I lost it on, in a friendly. Big time. I thought we probably one of the guys I call one of my closest friends in the team. Almost everybody in the team's a friend, but probably one of my closest friends in the team was the person I lost at me most that day. Wasn't a nice thing to do. Was a nice feeling afterwards. The probably had a lot of things on my mind at that time, but still no excuse. And the result was I lost the captaincy. It's actually better than last year. I think we've actually gelled and uh, had more more of a laugh this year than we have had last year. Last year was like arguments and uh, people moaning at one another. But I think this year, this year's been different. I think this year's been we've actually calmed down and actually played for one another this year. With that solidarity, the High Kill boys leave the competition standing. But how do they compete against each other? Man. 
With 10 years of history behind them, it's still upwards and onwards for High Hill. New and affected players are always made to feel welcome. I came to High Hill about two months ago now. My old team they used to play Wilton Gill. They split up. Stevie the manager for us. Said if I take him down play at friendly and see how it went from there. I came down and enjoyed the game. Got to know the boys through the two months. Everybody's been spot on ways. But we've always had a good team, but the stage that we wanted was to be recognised as one of the best teams in Sunday football. I think the team for seen la for the couple of months that I've played last season, everybody they're all good players. It's a well organised team. Everybody seems to be really friendly in the team. No see everybody seems to know each other. So I think next season they could go on. Finish second last year, hope for a challenge for a couple of cups and maybe win the league. There's another tough season ahead, but Hag Hill are ready for the challenge and ready for another 10 years. He'll see Hag Hill! <laughs> Remember the old days, just follow me. Some kind of magic 